More changes are on the way as part of the nationwide shift toward the next generation 911 system. Our Sarah Winkleman spoke to Crowan County about their latest efforts. Dispatch, Scott. Scott has been working at the Crowing County Dispatch Center for 22 years, answering emergency phone calls. Sure, what is your location? As part of the next generation 911 phase, just last month Minnesota made text to 911 available statewide, saying call if you can, text if you can't. From people who can't, who have difficulty breathing and they're texting to 911 for an ambulance or people that can't talk. Uh, for whatever reason, can text to 911, which is great. Crowing County is now planning for the next phase that will include not only texting, but also sending photos, videos, or other forms of broadband data. Next Generation 911 is all about giving more information, all by using your cell phone. It's really an opportunity to utilize these devices, um, you know, with all the technology that's available and tie that into the 911 system so we can provide more efficient, um, effective responses to these emergency calls. In order for the system to work properly, the county must first standardize the data. Another phase is the uh, GIS or um, the mapping phase of it, um, where we're all going to share the same map system across the state. Crowing County has been working with Pro West and Associates on the Geographic Information Systems, or GIS. Address data, GPS locations, and then we got roads. And so within that data, we have the call that comes in, and then it gets plotted against the um, MSEG, which then pulls in the response information, and then it gets plotted on the map. Which will be a large adjustment for those working at the public safety answering points. It's a big technology change, but uh, well, I'm embracing it, and that, that we have to keep up with the private companies, the private cell phone companies, and all the smart technology that's out there. But for now, remember to call if you can and text if you can't. Reporting in Brainerd, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. The new functions for the next generation 911 could launch by 2020. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.